important thing to remember about uh, this course is that we work off of two-week units. So um, instead of maybe a regular course where you have each unit is one week long, our units are two weeks long. And so the first half of the unit, the main idea is in the first week is we want to dig into the readings and kind of soak them in. Right. We don't want to try to read them in, the, in two days and then have to talk about them and then suddenly we're on to the next topic. Uh, so the first week is really kind of about sitting and in my mind stewing in the readings themselves. And at the end of that, of our first unit, you'll have to tell the rest of the class about what, what you learned. Um, and then you'll need to apply and answer some questions. Um, after that, the second week will be about engagement uh, with the material and with uh, your fellow students and myself. So, um, so there we'll be doing mo mostly replies. And the idea behind the replies is we want you to move the conversation forward. We don't want, hey, this is a great idea and I disagree with you and then we don't have anything else to say. Instead, I want you to probe uh, the responses of your fellow students and either bring up issues that they didn't think about. So, um, you know, maybe we didn't think about how this applies in economics. That might be something. Or this is a good idea, but if we did this, we might have these other consequences that might not be as, uh, that might be harmful. Um, that type of stuff, right? So we want to not just like attack, well, we certainly don't want to attack the person, but we don't want to attack uh, the idea and, and play devil's advocate. Uh, instead, we want to um, try to, in good faith, broaden uh, the application of the ideas that we're playing with. And we're going to play with all kinds of ideas each week. Uh, so we really just want to try to spread that around as much as possible. So really that's what our discussions are about. Um, in terms of my engagement in discussion, uh, there'll be times whenever I get in and I'm you know, saying, hey, what about this? Or you, you got Immanuel Kant's, uh, you got him wrong, and so just you know, think about it this way. Um, other times I'll be answering your questions. Uh, so if a lot of people ask, hey, uh, how do we apply, you know, Kant's thinking in this situation? Well, I'll pop in and I'll say, well, here's how people have traditionally uh, done that. Um, something else I'm, I may do is as I gather questions from you, I might make a short video that addresses some of the uh, more difficult uh, concepts that you all are wrestling with. Uh, sometimes just me talking with you like this uh, will be easier for you to grasp some of the concepts than if I try to type it all out. Um, so anyway, that's kind of how um, I approach engagement and discussion. It's one of my goals to try to walk that fine line between being too engaged in the discussion to where suddenly I'm dominating this, the discussion and you're just reacting to me versus being kind of like aloof and ignoring what you all are dealing with. So um, I try to find a good balance between there. So I try to kind of maintain distance, but also engage where appropriate. Um, so anyway, that's, that's how we kind of think about and do discussions in this class. Thank you.